Today has been organized chaos. Uh, the wind was blowing too strong and the crane operator said it's outside the operating window of the crane. So we've uh, kind of sat around waiting for the wind to come down and uh, now we're getting all the rest of the gear also loaded onto the ship. Uh, establishing our territories and uh, trying to get everything secured so that when the boat does leave it's not going to roll around or fall off. There are six people in the crew, uh, a captain, a mate, two deckhands, uh, a cook and an engineer. We rely on the crew to not only keep the sheep running, but to supply that support on deck. They run the winches, they run the heavy equipment. So the crew is just essential. They're an extension of the science team. There's 13 scientists going. Uh, there's one marine mammal and seabird observer who will be working from the flying bridge. We have a team that's doing the iron work. We'll be doing the physics, we'll be uh, collecting the nutrients that fuel the plants, as well as collecting samples to actually go and look at what particular uh, single-celled plants are present and the single-celled predators that are often forgotten in these ecosystems. Then we'll be using nets to collect uh, the zooplankton, which is the focus of my, my own personal research. A variety of disciplines are there that naturally fit together as opposed to someone going out looking at just a small part of the ecosystem and then wondering why it looks like it does. When we spoke last, it was two weeks ago, and we had high hopes and bright, shiny eyes about how fun and easy the cruise was going to be. And now we're back and uh, much more aware of the reality of the way things went. Uh, we had our ups and downs on the cruise, as is pretty typical for most cruises. Um, you know, on average, I would say we had more trouble this cruise than what I'm used to. Put up with a uh, fairly poor luck run of weather which was always kind of at the edge of being workable to completely unworkable. And by that, I mean, you can be standing on the back of the boat and you can be going up and down like 10 to 15 feet in just a few seconds. It gets to be hard on the people. It gets to be hard on the gear. And then we headed over to the sound, absolutely perfect conditions. It was great to get that kind of experience where the work's no longer challenging or, or, or frustrating and when you can just enjoy what you're doing. and if Generally, most of the work on this cruise is collecting things. So uh, we collect the samples, we preserve them, we put them away, and the processing, which is a time-consuming part, actually happens in the lab uh, over the next year. We actually did pretty well considering some of the, the handicaps we dealt with. The remarkable thing is after we really weren't very happy for the first week and a half, every, everybody's impressions turned around completely. <laughs> 